Yeah. This is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, I, I've seen the same thing with uh, the the level editor in Super Smash Bros. Like, I think there... Oh, yeah. I, I saw... <laughs> yeah, I saw, like, a, a level where it was, like, Mario, like, in, like, a Speedo or something like that. Like, <laughs> like the whole level was just that. <laughs> I would pay... I would pay so much money to watch, like, a Sakurai reacts to what people have done with like smack in general like not just the level <laughs> editor but like mods and stuff he's so rigid in what he wants the game to be it's so funny or, this is I not how you play the game be like smash bros mod squidward versus shrek and it'll be like <laughs> king ddds shrek and squidward is like i don't even know and it's like they all they did was swap out like the main like c not cgi computer generated like, like character model. asset yeah. but like yeah. the boxes are the same so the character gets like all screwed up when they're like doing like the attack of the <laughs> mark but it's like your squidward but like yeah it doesn't work <laughs> that, that sounds amazing i I, so I don't funny. think i've ever seen anything like that yeah i would love to like, see him react to that if people do that well, stuff with air jared i'm all for it i would sit with popcorn and just watch it all night oh yeah i'm, I'm sure like that's like one of the um things like a lot of developers and like musicians like myself too like also kind of um look forward to one day is like starting to get like fan um remakes Edits. of things yes. yeah yeah because that means like people are watching and people are following and people are getting are interacting with your the stuff that you make you know yeah i because w- i wouldn't even be like mad like oh you're screwing with my like body of work but it's like a, it's hilarious, and B, mm-hmm. like, it means you have fans, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, people are taking your thing and, like, making something with it, so. I'm going to make a note here that I'm going to speed run Arid Jared. I'm going to be the first one oh my on God. the leaderboards. <laughs> Please. Maybe I'll purposely put in some, like, game-breaking stuff for you to, like, find. <laughs> Dude. That, that would be a good, like... um part of like the marketing campaign is like is sitting down and like do going through it like mm-hmm. like as fast as possible that would be cool too it's yeah i sometimes like it's weird when i'm programming i actually do think like i have the thought like how would like a speedrunner think about this like and i'm not making the game based on like a speedrunner's mindset um mm-hmm. but like it is interesting to think about um i liked i think it was a quote from Miyamoto, actually, I would have mm-hmm. to find who said this, but um, it was basically like a good puzzle has multiple solutions, or a good objective has multiple mm-hmm. solutions. So, like, mm-hmm. if the goal is to get from A to B, give the player more than one option to get there. And mm-hmm. so, like, my interpretation of that for Era Jared is creating different spells to use because they all function essentially the same. Like, like I said, there's no um, way to increase the strength. Like, one hit is one hit, no matter what spell you mm-hmm. use. Um, mm-hmm. But because of that, I'm changing, like, the properties so you have different options of, like, what spell to assign to him. And then you can only take one spell into a level at a time. So that's, like, what you're stuck with and, unless you go and change it. Okay. In the so, like, mm-hmm. the main one...